What is Let Me Play? Let Me Play. Well, we do just that. We let young people play. Let Me Play started with a basketball camp, and now we run basketball, street dance, and football camps. High scoring, you know, it's tailored as a spectator sport. The kid, she's like, come on, let's go. <laughs> I keep going. Keep it nice and fair. You can tackle Amy and Matt in any way you want. <laughs> but the rest of them be easy with them, yeah? I'll be okay. oh, my it's not just camps that we do, we do sports tours. We've had tours to Spain, Italy, Germany. We also have foreign groups that come to the UK. Um, I've actually been part of Let Me Play now. This is my third year. I was there for the first year in Holland, my last year in Cardiff, and this year now. And it's wonderful just to see how it's going. We both have backgrounds in sport. I used to play professional basketball and Amy used to work at professional football clubs both in the USA and the UK. Our coaching staff travel from America and across Europe to bring these camps together. We've got nutritionists, strength and conditioning coaches. I'm a basketball player. I played in high school and college in the States. Entertainment is myself and Carmel's life. We love it, we enjoy it. Welsh national under 16 head coach. I've been coaching the new level, national team level. And we're trying to bring these people together to provide the ultimate sporting experience for a week. They're loving it, it's a fun camp, they're enjoying it, they're learning at the same time. All the conditioning, all the training, you've got all the nutrition, you've got like first class people coming in. The kids have actually responded really well. We've all learned a lot. It's like the full What's the best thing about Dan? He offers loads of good advice. Dan Chitu is an incredible role model. Everybody looking good? Everybody got their makeup on? Yeah, yeah. He's a professional footballer that spends a lot of time helping young people. He puts his name to it because he's actually there. I really want to open a kid. And I think that's a big difference. He's at our camps as much as he can be around his own training schedule. I've been through you know, a tough time in football and you learn so much and I've always wanted to, you know, give back. In Dan Shitu, we're able to bring someone to young people and to actually teach them what it takes to be a professional. It's about what you do off the pitch as well. He spends hours talking with these kids in the evening just to make sure that they realise how important it is to work hard, to make good decisions in life, to do well in school. You know, this is all away from the football pitch. It's just about, you know, these guys coming in, enjoying themselves, and you know, just learning that one thing. If it's to open up, if it's to work harder in school, if it's to work harder in football. While we're creating a camp, we're providing these young people with role models who want to be there and give up their time and their knowledge. And they pulled it off, they've actually done more than what we expected. The feedback we've got after camp, it's been incredible. I suppose Lee's testimony is that they come back and they bring their friends and that's part of our growth process as well. I want to live here for like a yeah. whole year. Yeah. I love it. I don't want to go home back to reality. So you live down low basketball before you came here? Yeah, I came here last year. Look. Not only that, the parents. I'm really, really pleased. Like, really yeah. like, she's really enjoying herself. What better feedback can we ever get? Would you recommend it for the people? Definitely, yeah. She yeah. would definitely come back to the show. Alright. Probably good afternoon. That's what I'm talking about. They write to us, they send us emails. A couple of weeks later you get letters or emails from parents that are saying that, you know, my son was very quiet and you know now he's you know very outgoing and he's trying harder in school. It really uh, makes it all very worthwhile. We come here like we didn't know each other, we all met each other. And if you think that like you're not gonna make friends you're gonna be the only one who can't do it, like you won't everyone's really nice. It's worth the hard work um, if they're coming back and they love it like we do. So have Let Me Play as a part of some of the regular life. Where it comes to the holiday period, they're thinking which camp am I going to go to? Going to camps. I think if you learn from all those coaches a variety of backgrounds, you'll get a great perspective on how different people teach the game. When you're at a camp, you can learn the flavor they'll go through with you, like how to move, like it's, it's more broken down because you have a longer time. We love what we do and we hope that comes over in the camps and the passion that we put behind everything. Tools that you could use here at camp and then take away and practice those skills at home. And as a result, if you're serious about it, can become a better player. Because with hard work, time, practice, effort, determination. Just wanting to do it. Yeah, and that goes, that's just life generally. Yeah. Only you are your, do you know what I mean, your own mental, your own strength. You've got to push yourself. So we love what we do and we're trying to find organisations and people that have the same philosophies. 
we're big believers in learning away from the basketball court or the football pitch or the dance studio. We believe that if we can engage with young people through sport, then we're able to talk to them about other matters. The theoretical side to sport, and we're very much there to teach young people that as well. It's been a thoroughly enjoyable experience the last few years. We've been going from strength to strength, and we hope to expand. We're looking at starting Let Me Play Tennis and Let Me Play Rugby in the near future as well. We've got the vehicle to really move forward now and to expand throughout the whole of the UK. I hope it gives young people these unique opportunities to experience sport, to play, to enjoy their youth. And if we can start to do that with the help of partners and sponsors, um, then that would be great.